Hello, uh, this is JS Danwell, and today I'd like to demo how to uh, use ArcMap report template and to create a report. Uh, because E3 now does not uh, support uh, Chris report uh, anymore, so we would like to use E3 report uh, instead of Chris report. So when you open ArcMap, uh, go to View, you can find a uh, Create a Report. And here you can create a report, follow the report wizard. And when you create a report, and you can save the report as template. And uh, I already created a report here, and now I can use the node report and the node report template. And uh, you see, this is the report I created. So, very nice and very easy to use. And when we have a Chris the report template, and we can use the we can use the Visual Studio 2010 and uh, use the E3 add-in template and. Uh, when you, you uh, when you install the app objects in your computer you will have those uh, easily add in and template. Okay and let's open Visual Studio, go to new, go to project and you will see there is a ArcGIS and a desktop add in and uh, and today I just want to them how to use uh, desktop add-in actually ArcMap add-in yeah if you use the Visual C sharp then you can use the same thing here yeah I already use uh, ArcMap add-in create the uh, Visual Studio project and uh, I show you this is the project I created use this the U3 ArcMap add-in. When you use the ArcMap add-in templates, it will automatically fill all the information here. And you can amplify this here. And also when you use that uh, add-in template, it's already because this add-in I created is a button, and you see when the button click event, and uh, you can hook up ArcMap application here. When you click the button, and um, I open a form. I there there is a form here I created. This form. I create this form because the list box I want to list the templates I have, and uh, and then this uh, text box when you select a template, it will show you uh, what uh, a data field you will use to create a report. And uh, when you have because of the template you created using ArcMap and uh, is already uh, there, so here we just need to uh, click a generator, click button, and uh, using that template uh, automatically create a PDF uh, report. <coughs> Now let's go to let's run this uh, uh, project. Okay, I don't, I don't need this. Okay, when I run my add-in in the debug mode, 
I can go to because of the debug you don't need to install so it automatically installed for you and when you run the debug uh, uh, debug mode and I put the ad in in the GIS I think GIS yeah add in control okay this is my add in and I click this you see because I uh, already created uh, two report templates so I have two report templates to select and I can select this first one address is ordered by street you see it will give me the information which field you will use actually I just use the name and the full address field so I can generate a report here I just select yeah and uh, give a name and save this save this you see this is the report I created yeah I, I format it as a, a main enable actually here okay so when we select another template we can see which field we use to create this report yeah I want to give a street object ID report so yeah they also ask you to give a name I just give Random give a name here. Yeah, it create a report for you. Uh, you can see it's very easy to create a report because you can use ArcMap create a report templates. You can preview your report here and then you use the uh, Visual Studio 2010 and uh, easily uh, add in ArcMap templates and uh, create a uh, and, uh, project and uh, and give this uh, add in to user and they will create they, they can use your add in create a report quickly so even now we don't have a quiz report I think use the E3 report we can create a very nice report quickly I think it's more easy for us to create a report than using quiz report because quiz report and at some point I think it's a little more complicated than uh, this report However, I think because usually now does not support at 10.1 does not support Chris report and we should adapt to using uh, user report. Okay, uh, this is what I want to demo today and thank you very much for your watching and have a good day and see you next time.